Hey rappers, what's good? In this video, I'm gonna be talking to you about four ways rappers can grow their YouTube channels. Hey, what's up? My name is Hitplay of hitplaybeats.com and my goal is to help provide rappers with the knowledge they're gonna need in order to turn their dreams into their careers. So if you're a serious rapper, make sure you go ahead and you hit that subscribe button down below and you click the notification bell to get notified every time I release a new video. Also, if you like any of the beats you hear in the background of this video, I'll have all the direct links to each of those beats in the description below. So on YouTube, I see a lot of artists that aren't taking full advantage of what they can actually achieve and do on YouTube. I see a lot of guys that all you're really doing is you're just posting your original music which is cool there's nothing wrong with doing that but there's so many other opportunities that you can use and so many other ideas and like concepts you can use to pull more potential fans into your world and to your channel and get traffic on a daily basis so i'm going to go over a couple ideas that you guys can expand upon on your own and you can make your own content your own way using these as like starting points so the first type of content that you can make that has nothing to do with your own music but it will still pull hip-hop fans to your channel it's going to be mixtape and album reviews from like other artists so because there's so much new music coming out on almost a monthly basis you can pretty much do this at least once even maybe twice or three times a month and just talk about your opinions and your thoughts on a specific album or mixtape that just got released by your favorite artist or by an artist that you're following. So the cool thing about doing this is the fact that you're not listening in terms of you being a fan, you're listening in terms of you being an artist. So you have a completely unique perspective on their album and their music. And you can take this a step further and make a single video on each single song of the mixtape or of the album or of that project. You can even do trending singles as well. So the second type of content that you can make is actually like reaction videos and so you've seen these a lot on YouTube probably if you ever look on and listen to like Drake or Cardi B or the Migos or anybody on YouTube I can just about guarantee that on the side panel you've seen like whatever the title of the album is reaction video right so those type of videos are actually really easy to make and it's literally again it's just your opinion and your thoughts while you're listening to the music and all you got to do is take your phone and have like some speakers playing and like just listen to the music talk to your phone go back listen to the music give your ideas be like like, oh, that was a dope bar. You're not really doing anything crazy and it's just another type of content that you can use to gain exposure and gain traffic to your YouTube channel. And those are really powerful because if you're one of the first few people to do one of those videos, I've seen, I forgot what song it was. I think it was a Drake song and it just came out. I think it had just hit like 10 million views. And so whenever I went and I listened to that song, I saw a reaction video on the side and it already had like a million views. When I went back, what, I think it was like a couple weeks later and I looked again because I wanted to see what the relationship was between them, the reaction video got 10% of the views that Drake's original music video got. That means that you potentially can be in front of 10,000 people and then in your reaction video, if you say, hey, I'm also I've like, I'm doing this as a perspective of an artist, I have my original music, you can check that out in the link in the description or like wherever, and you tell them where to listen to your music at, you can actually direct a ton of those people to your own original content. And so the third type of content that you can use to gain exposure to yourself and to your original music is actually doing remixes of popular songs. So I just did a video recently on how to do these remixes and like three reasons why every artist needs to be doing remixes. So I'm not really gonna go into the reasons why, but these are really, really effective because again, if you rank next to one of these artists that you just did the remix and you have the best remix and it's keeping people's attention the longest, you're gonna follow around that song for as long as that's a popular song. And most of these artists are promoting those songs for about a month, month and a half or so. So imagine you basically just got free marketing money onto like a percentage of their marketing budget onto your video. And so the fourth and final type of content that you can use to help grow your channel is something that you can do pretty much almost on a daily or weekly basis. And that's basically just your reaction and your thoughts to popular news in hip hop and rap like culture, basically. So one of the most recent events, at least at the time of me recording this video, is the whole 21 Savage thing where everybody found out that he's like British or something like that. So you can literally just record a video, put it up on YouTube about talking about like your reaction and like why it doesn't matter or why it does matter or how you feel about it and just talk. And like, because that's a trending topic, you're essentially newsjacking is what it's called. And you're essentially just getting people who are looking for that information or around that relevant information on YouTube and you're driving them to you. 
And again, this is another great opportunity for you to basically take a percentage of those people that are clicking onto your video and then just telling them like either in the beginning or at the end that, hey, I'm a rapper and this is my take on whatever. And like, by the way, if you wanna check out some of my original music, I'd really appreciate it. Links in the description, you can check it out at the end of this video or you can check it out right now or whatever, however you wanna say it. All right, so that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you go ahead and you hit that like button down below. And if you have any questions, comments, concerns, ideas for future videos, go ahead and drop that in the comment section down below as well. And until next time, guys, here are some more videos.